Logan, I hope you're playing Thomas like a fiddle. According to the bold and the beautiful spoilers and rumors, soap fans, as well as Thomas Forrester, Matthew Atkinson, may have underestimated Hope Logan, Annika Noel. Thomas and Hope's sparks have been flying recently on the bold and the beautiful, but there may be more going on than meets the eye. Logan should wear many hats. The CBS soap character is a designer, businesswoman, daughter, wife, and, most importantly, mother. Even if you don't like Hope Logan, you can't deny that she is a fantastic mother who takes her responsibility seriously. In fact, she has been raising Thomas' son Douglas Forrester for months while Thomas dealt with his issues. According to the bold and the beautiful spoilers, Thomas Forrester has turned over a new leaf, and he appears to charm the pants off everyone, including Douglas and Hope. Douglas Forrester has already stated his desire to be with his father. Hope and Liam Spencer, Scott Clifton, were heartbroken because they appeared to be losing their son. Is it possible that Hope Logan is manipulating Thomas Forrester in order to reclaim Douglas and reunite him with his family? Recently, there appears to be an underlying theme on soaps. Bill Spencer recently pulled a similar card with Sheila Carter, Kimberlyn Brown leaving fans perplexed for weeks until the big reveal. Interestingly, the reunion of Hope Logan and Thomas Forrester also makes no sense. Is Hope Logan on the bold and the beautiful using Thomas? Why would Hope disregard all the warning signs and start canoodling with Thomas? After everything Thomas has done to her and her family, the bold and the beautiful fans find it difficult to take the two of them seriously. Hope has either lost all self-respect and common sense, or she is using her ex for ulterior motives, such as getting Douglas away from him. I hope Logan keeps getting closer to crossing the line. Hope Logan was grounded her flight, to be exact, in today's episode of The Bold and the Beautiful, and she almost succumbed to a flight of fancy. Furthermore, Liam, Scott Clifton, complained that no one ever listens to his concerns about Hope Annika Noel, and Thomas, Matthew Atkinson. Let's delve a little deeper into what happened. Logan should get awfully close to Thomas. Hope and Thomas meeting with international buyers in San Francisco was a qualified success. Hope texted Liam to let him know the good news and to promise that she and Thomas would be on their way home soon. That, however, was not to be. Hope had barely sent that reassuring message when the pilot called to say that. Due to mechanical issues, they might not be able to take off that night. Hope then called Liam to update him, and he was dissatisfied. Worse, the only flight from San Francisco to Los Angeles was fully booked. Hope eventually agreed to join Thomas in indulging in some room service, rabbit food for her, make that a huge salad newise, an actual meal for him. The pair celebrated their previous success as well as their ongoing collaboration. Talk then turned to Brooks, Catherine Kelly Lang, less than savory past, and how it hangs over hope day in and day out, as it has lately. I'm my own individual. I'm not my mother, and her stupid excuse of following her heart. Really, she just leaves a devastation trail behind her. I never wanted to be that way. My principles and morals are important to me. Thomas assured Hope that she was the most principled, moral, and extraordinary person he'd ever met. In fact, she's nothing like Brooke. However, this is not the case. Hope and Thomas were soon in embracing and looking longingly into each other's eyes. I was with Liam when he got the call about Hope and Thomas's situation. Curses on Kelly for needing that bracelet that matches so perfectly with Bailey's. Steffi. Jacqueline Missins Wood. Stayed to hear Liam rant about how he never wanted his wife and Thomas to go to San Francisco in the first place and how he wouldn't put it past Thomas to take advantage of the situation. Steffi suggested that Liam give Thomas the benefit of the doubt, pointing out that it would save him some trouble in the long run, but Liam wasn't having it. He's seen Thomas descend into villainy far too often. Steffi tried to reassure Liam that he had nothing to worry about in terms of Hope and Thomas, but when pressed, she couldn't help but state emphatically that Thomas's feelings are under control and not something to be concerned about. 
Steffi springs into action after hope and the Thomas bold becomes and the beautiful spoilers for Friday, May 12, Whatever Can Go Wrong with Hope Spencer's, Annika Noel, and Thomas Forrester's, Matthew Atkinson, Trip, Will Go Wrong. Steffi Forrester, Jacqueline Miss Sins Wood, will step into care for Thomas and Hope. Steffi Forrester takes action. According to the bold and the beautiful spoilers, Steffi will have to think quickly when Hope and Thomas become stranded in San Francisco after meeting with the buyers, played by Vivian Huang and Quinn Knox. To get to their meeting on time, Thomas and Hope took the Forrester jet. Hope also double-checked that they would be able to return home on time. When it comes time to return to Los Angeles, Hope and Thomas are surprised to learn that their flight has been delayed. Hope promised Liam that they would be home as soon as this meeting was finished, but it now appears that they will be stuck overnight due to the delay. This will not sit well with Liam or Steffi. D and B. Liam Spencer is concerned. Liam is already nervous about this trip, so when he learns of the delay, he panics. Liam already doesn't trust Thomas alone with Hope, and the fact that they're stranded makes matters worse. Liam knows Hope will return home eventually, but he is concerned about what will happen before she does. Carter Walton dismisses Hope and Thomas. Recap of the bold and the beautiful, it's most likely the worst thing he's ever done. And that's saying a lot. Carter Walton enlisted the Hope for the future team, minus Zen because, why include him? For a schmoozing mission in today's episode of The Bold and the Beautiful. Furthermore, Finn's, Tanner Novlin, and Steffi's, Jacqueline Miss Sinswood, attempts at intimacy were repeatedly interrupted by an irritated Liam, Scott Clifton. Let's delve a little deeper into what happened. Carter Walton wishes Hope and Thomas a Merry Christmas. Carter, Lawrence St. Victor, had received word that some of the most powerful buyers in the fashion world, the kind who can make or break a line, had flocked to San Francisco and were requesting a meeting with Hope, Annika Noel, and Thomas Matthew Atkinson that very day. The pair agreed because it would only be a short flight there and back. But there was Liam in the middle of it all. And no sooner had Thomas guessed that Liam wouldn't be overjoyed by the idea than Liam was in the doorway, wondering what the it was that he wasn't overjoyed about. Hope explained the situation in broad strokes, so Liam couldn't figure out what he didn't like. Then it gradually dawned on him that Thomas would be accompanying Hope. Thomas left the couple, fearful of an eruption, and Hope set about convincing Liam that this trip was necessary and that she'd be back in no time. He also had nothing to be concerned about in terms of Thomas. Hope thanked Liam for his support and the way he looked out for her and swore she didn't take any of it for granted as he gave his approval for the trip, as if Hope would have canceled if he hadn't. He's also the one and only man she's committed to. Foiled yet again curses. Across the hall, Steffi and Finn exhaled a sigh of relief as the coast was finally clear, or so they thought. Steffi had just said that locking the door was unnecessary because her employees knew better than to just burst in when Thomas burst in and chastised them for not locking the door. Rather than throwing Thomas out so they could enjoy their rare alone time, Steffi and Finn stood around and talked with him about his upcoming trip with Hope, which they'd learned about from Carter.